Hello and welcome to episode 38 of my Subnautica tutorial let's play series. This episode will be on getting the Repulsion Cannon data box. Um, so let's go get it. Right, for those of you that don't have a compass, uh, I'm buying my life pod just there and to the left of me is the back of the Aurora turning this way just there, 943 metres away, is the Repulsion Cannon data box. For those that do have a compass, it's to the right of south. Right, let's head on over and get it. Slowly getting all your blueprints. Maybe I'll make the uh, Cyclops soon. Will be nice to, to make the Cyclops because it's a mobile base and it powers itself. So we can uh, make the power cell charger, put it in it, and it will charge up the power cells and not use power for doing it. That will get to that, I guess. Can sort of use it for clearing early areas of resources question is though, what do you put in the Cyclops? The prawn suit or the Seamoth? Prawn suit of course is excellent for diving in small areas where it goes deep, like the deep sparse reef. So maybe I'll switch between both. Okay, so oops, I should be showing, sorry, the uh, biome coordinates. So we're just going through, through the Grand Reef. Oh, and I'm being attacked by that nasty. Get away from him. Now, where's my. No, did it destroy, dis destroy my seam? No, no, there's my seam. I've caught panic over. So, yeah, we're going through the Grand Reef. And let's get through it quick. That nasty thing. So you can see, you can be attacked. Right. So we're coming up to 200. Well, 170 meters. 190. That'll do you. Get out there. And it's back to this big wreck. Right. Let's grab my beacon first. And let's go get ourselves a repulsion cannon. Right, so in this room, go through here. So you'll need your laser cutters. Oh, no, get myself a bit lost. Get myself very lost. twists and turns there we go finally right so as you can see repulsion cannon data box and there we go we now got the repulsion cannon right nothing else in there now so we can get out okay so there we go that's showing you how to get the repulsion cannon yeah I know I did get myself in a bit of a muddle but then as long as you've got your laser cutters, you might have to dive in a couple of times to cut the different doors open. And you might get a bit lost like me, so I hope you followed a previous episode where I showed getting the enhanced oxygen tank. Which, even if you bungle around like me, you should have plenty of oxygen to get in and out. Like so. There we go, I'll end the episode here. It was just to show how to get that propulsion cannon. Wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep you safe. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.